you must have used dextrose 5 percent hundreds of times but do you know if it is a isotonic or a hypotonic fluid or if it is used as a maintenance fluid or a resuscitation fluid friends in today's video we are going to discuss every detail about dextrose 5 percent and at the end of the video, I am going to give you an important tip about its administration. This tip is very important because if you don't follow it, not only this fluid administration will be useless, but it can also be harmful. So friends, watch this video till the end. And if you have come for the first time on this channel, then do subscribe this channel for more such clinical videos. And also an interesting quiz on this topic is waiting for you in the description box you can check that quiz after watching this video so friends without wasting much time let's start our video so first we will see what is the composition of this fluid and some basic concepts so in five percent dextrose there is five grams of glucose in 100 ml of water or there is 50 grams of glucose in 1 liter of water. As this fluid contains dextrose, it also provides some energy. So, it provides about 170 kilocalories in 1 liter of 5% dextrose. And what is the osmolarity of this fluid? The osmolarity of this fluid is 278 milliosmoles per liter and the osmolarity of the plasma human plasma is 275 to 295 so according to this dextrose 5 percent must be a isotonic fluid but what happens when this fluid is introduced in the body the glucose is completely metabolized and what remains is only plain water and then this fluid becomes a hypotonic fluid. So, this fluid is isotonic in the bottle but it is hypotonic in the body. This is the very important basic concept. Now, we will see how this fluid is distributed inside body after introduction. So, this is a intracellular compartment and this is the extracellular compartment. Two third of body's water is present intracellularly and one third of body's water is present in the extracellular compartment. And we know that dextrose 5% is just plain water. So, when one liter of dextrose 5% dextrose is given to the patient. This uh, 1 liter is distributed exactly in this same proportion in the body. So, about 333 ml will go to the extracellular compartment and about 667 will go to the intracellular compartment. Now, this extracellular compartment of this one third about one fourth of fluid is present in the intravascular compartment and the remaining three fourth it is present in the intercellular spaces. So, if we take uh, one fourth of this 333, it comes about 85 to 86. So, when one liter of 5 percent dextrose is given to patient, only about 85 to 86 ml of fluid stays in the blood or the volume of blood is increased by only 85 to 86 ml and that is the reason this dextrose 5 percent is not suitable for resuscitation or in the cases of shock. So, now what are the indications of dextrose 5 percent? It is a best maintenance fluid in fasting patient. It is for two reasons. First, it provides water and second, it also provides calories. And it is very widely used in pre-op and post-op patients where they are in the fasting state. Then it is also used to correct intracellular dehydration in severe vomiting, diarrhea, burns, etc. It is also used for hypernitremia correction because it provides plain simple water. 
it is also used in the treatment of hypoglycemia because of its content of glucose it is also used as a diluent for certain drugs especially in the icu and as it contains glucose it is also used in the prevention of ketosis especially in the cases of vomiting and uh, high grade fever so these are the indications of dextrose 5 percent then what are the contraindications it is not useful in shock or hypovolemia as i have already explained a very few quantity of this fluid stays in the intravascular compartment it is not useful in shock or hypovolemia it is also not useful in head injury raised intracranial pressure or neurosurgery this is because it is a hypotonic fluid for example now this is brain and this is the blood vessel so when you give dextrose five percent it is a hypotonic fluid so all this fluid will ultimately get into brain and it will cause cerebral edema so that is the reason it is not not used in head injury raise intracranial pressure or neurosurgery then it is also contraindicated in hyponatremia because it will aggravate this condition more it is also not useful uh, or contraindicated in severe hyperglycemia because it contains dextrose and it is also not to be given with blood transfusion because again it is a hypotonic fluid and this fluid will enter into the rbc's which get swell and ultimately there will be hemolysis so whenever you are giving blood transfusion and dextrose they should not be given in the same line now what are the problems one can face while giving dextrose five percent so as as it contains dextrose it can lead to a local pain, vein irritation or thrombophlebitis. And if this fluid is given for a long time, there can be hypokalemia. There can also be hypomagnesemia and hypophosphatemia. So if you are giving this fluid for a longer time, then you have to add electrolytes in the fluid. And now the most important thing is about the administration. So whenever you are giving this fluid, you have to see that the rate of administration must not exceed 5.5 grams per kg per hour so when you are giving dextrose 5 percent to any patient your rate of administration must never exceed 0.5 gram per kg per hour and why this is important because if you exceed this rate there will be glycosuria the uh, level of glucose in the blood will rise suddenly and this will lead to osmotic diuresis so instead of correcting dehydration there will be more dehydration in the patient if you give uh, dextrose 5 percent uh, by more than 0.5 gram per kg per hour so for example if there is a patient of say 50 kg so 50 into 0 0.5 it will be 25 grams and we have seen that each 100 ml each 100 ml of dextrose 5 percent contains 5 grams so if there is a 50 kg patient you cannot give fluid at the rate of more than 500 ml per hour so if you give this patient a dextrose 5 percent by more than 500 ml per hour this fluid will be useless and it will cause more dehydration so it is a most important tip that you should keep in mind while administering dextrose five percent so in the summary dextrose five percent remains a free water after metabolism it is not a resuscitation fluid it is used mainly as a maintenance fluid and for hypernitremia it is contraindicated in neurotrauma and neurosurgery because it leads to cerebral edema and if you have to give this fluid for a longer time then you have to combine it with electrolytes
So whenever you will pick dextrose five percent for your patient, think for some time if you are giving water or you are giving volume. Dextrose five percent is a terrible resuscitation fluid, but a good maintenance fluid. Know the difference, use it wisely, and your patient will thank you. Friends, if you find today's video helpful, give it a like, share with your friends, and if you have come for the first time on this channel, then do subscribe this channel for more such clinical videos. And also, don't forget to solve the quiz that is present in the description box. See you in the next video. Till then, thank you.